Kia ora whanau. just thought I'd join you with Mrs Horn and Mr P. We're just in the new buildings. How are you going? Kia ora. Hi. So yeah, I uh, thought we'd bring you over and give you a quick tour of where we're up to and a bit of a plan, so come for a look. So here we are, we're in the western end of the building, um, looking in what will be Mrs Bellamy's, Mr Barnard's and Mr Franks' space. So quite a big space, a um, little breakout space, a bit of a quieter area in there for the kids. And as we come outside, you can see we've got a really nice big outdoor, outdoor covered area for the kids. Cool part about this space here, uh, another breakout space where Mr P and Mrs Horn are having a look. Another cool part about this space is this is actually going to be a kitchen. So the Moa kids and any other kids in the school will be able to incorporate some hands-on learning with uh, in and around Kai and food, which is going to be pretty cool. And then out the back here, again, we're really fortunate to have these big covered outdoor areas. So really an extension of the classroom, um, which will be in there. So uh, this is the northern part. Um, sorry, the western part of the building. So moving into the middle section uh, of the building, this is where Mr Vaughan and Miss Slatter will be. So again, another big space. You don't quite get the whole idea of how big it is through here with all the uh, construction materials in, in front of us here. But uh, we, have, we have glass sliding doors between the spaces, so don't panic, they're not all wide open like that. Let's see if I can get the, the frame in. There for you, so that's all covered, and they'll have um, they'll have school motifs on them to visually block out. We've got another uh, breakout space in there that will be shared with the other room over there. Uh, and again, these guys get access through to the main part of the school through these doors here, and access to that covered walkway and their breakout space in there. All right, moving into the last of the three pairs of teaching rooms, we have what will be Miss Braid and uh, Miss Braid and um, Mrs. Askin. Mrs. Askin. So this is their space. Uh, again, nice big space, big windows, lots of natural light. Uh, they do have the internal access uh, for the bathrooms. Um, you may wonder why internal access, part of the ministry standards, if we were to go into a lockdown or something like that. I uh, hope we never have to, but the children have access to the bathrooms from internal, don't have to go uh, outside the building to use the bathrooms in that kind of emergency situation. But the main door that the kids will use will be this door outside to access the, uh, the unisex bathrooms. We have another breakout space in that area, which is where our international students are going to go. And then that little nook in behind there, Mr P and Mrs Horn there. And then uh, these guys have access to the breakout in that room there. So it's kind of shared between the two spaces. And the last part that these guys get, which is pretty cool, these guys get big access to a, another big outdoor covered learning area as well. So look, everything's coming along pretty nicely. We're doing pretty well uh, on track that our more kids will be in here at the beginning of term two. If we're lucky, maybe in that gap after Easter before we go on term two holidays. So far, I hope you're all good. Uh, and gives you another little insight of to where we're up to. Take care.